Fio has officially launched their brand new R9 music player. Now, this is a very expensive music player. It's going to be priced at $1,500 right now. The thing here is that this model is going to be a very versatile all-in-one streamer it has a DAC it has a headphone amplifier that, that even offers possibility uh, for a lot of options for you you know you can do much with this unit you can use it as a straight up DAC you can use it with the amp inside uh, and then you can even use it to stream a variety of um, of online uh of online music and easily this thing can do a lot um it, in fact you can even customize it to seemingly integrate into your desktop and speaker setup with ease uh it has a very high power output um it's good in terms of its uh in terms of its design i like what i see already um in terms of its form factor i like it it comes with an lcd screen that uh that kind of like resembles a very large uh, digital audio player uh the r9 is the company's uh flagship it's gonna be their flagship is their completed missing flagship they already have the r7 so the r9 will now be their flagship uh so let's take a look at what you get inside so the highlights is that they've uh, made use of a dual eight channel ess 9038 pro uh, pro DAC chips inside here uh, and they connected it in parallel for a fully differential output this thing is a beast in many respects this is the same flagship chip set on their on their top level uh, m17 digital audio player which you easily it has a signal a noise ratio on channel separation uh when compared to the r7 so this thing is just insane in terms of build quality inside the r9 uh the, the, there is the new um, 40 watts low noise uh psu uh dac as well as amplification sections that are all on separate boards with metallic shielding so the, this will allow you to avoid avoid cross talks and enhance the performance so this thing has a lot there is usb decoding section that has been upgraded uh, with 16 core there is also xmos xu 316 uh, solution uh, the fact that it supports high res uh, of um, 32 bit 768 kilohertz there is uh, the fact that it has dsd 512 support um it, it really has everything it has streaming options it is good in every regard then the fact that the r9 um you can connect the r9 to your 5g wi-fi network through its lan port is fantastic um uh, so it's really good in every respect that you can imagine there's a dedicated bluetooth chipset um uh, comes with uh, the qcc 5125 uh inside that's uh, there's also support for ldac on bluetooth connection with so as well as the fact it works with apple products as well so this thing is is a beast and then the r r9 doubles the amplification section uh, and has a monstrous uh fully balanced eight channel model of the TA, thx uh triple a as uh, triple a uh, triple 788 plus amplification and they are all connected in parallel um through a two by two array of uh of four-way but fully balanced architecture design so this thing is a humongous beast uh there is a new up amp sections here it's really good it has a 7.3 watts of output into 32 ohms and uh this thing this thing can pump out a lot of 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 wattage into any headphone uh any headphone or iem that you put it put in through its connectors uh so it has a lot 7.5 watts is insane that's really big um so that's it the the, the display on it is six inches and it has a, resol a resolution of 21 60 by 1080p uh, so it's a full uh, hd resolution screen so i will drop details for you guys to check it out below do subscribe to the channel do like our content i'll see you guys very much